What is good everybody, it is your boy Cab back with another Xenoverse 2 video for you guys. Today we're here to take a look at the newest TP Metal Shop update. Now there is no free update things or anything like that going on. Obviously the free update at this point in time is over two months old. So I figured I'd come with this right here just to see how many people actually want this to continue because there were people saying that they would like me to do this on a regular occasion when I was doing them for the free update. So let me know down below in the comments whether or not you would just prefer these TP Metal Shop update videos videos to be done when it's around like DLC times, free update times, things along those lines, or just in general when we do get them on the regular. But with that being said, we are going to take a quick look at the TP Metal Shop to see what is available in it. Now, first and foremost, I will take a look at the clothing just to show you guys once again. Those 30k outfits and just very expensive festival outfits are not back. Maybe they'll only be around when the festival is actually going on because it has been quite some time since we have seen those in the TP metal shop but there is nothing really new in the clothing section in the skill section there's not much that you know a lot of people would be interested in if you are someone who is newer to the game there may be some stuff here like sort of hope uh divine lasso skills like that that you may be interested in if you have not gotten them already but overall nothing too crazy going on in the skill section in the super soul section we do have a super soul i believe this was from dlc it was either dlc 16 or dlc 15 i cannot say for sure but what this super soul does is when the battle begins your key is completely restored and then when a charge key blast hit it temporarily boosts the amount of key you restore by an xl amount so it is something that you could use in you know uh, with super saiyan blue or blue evolution potentially you just have to make sure that you continue to use charge key blast in some way shape or form to get that key res restoration boost up to that xl amount which is a 20 percent increase to the amount of key that you do gain back when you actually attack someone when you're getting attacked clashing all things along those lines now besides that we come over to the cc mascots there are a lot of them as you can see right here multiple different variations of different cc mascots all things like that um but moving on to the artworks there is a in particular artwork that i think is one of the best in the game if you have not gotten it already right here with this vegeta one this is to me one of the absolute best artworks that this game has to offer bar none like without a doubt this is definitely one of the best artworks in all of Xenoverse 2. This and the Goku one that is just like this, to me, are by far two of my favorite. Like, this design and style, along with the one where, like, Go uh, Broly is all highlighted and you got the black background going on, that style as well of artworks are very, very clean to me. Like, I just love both of those. And again, this is one of my favorites right here, without a doubt. But besides that, I mean, nothing too crazy good. I mean, this Yamcha one kind of does go a little bit hard. I'm not going to lie. It is a fairly old one, though. But if you had not gotten it up until this point, now is the time to do so. And for anybody that is wondering, I am on Xbox, so you can see everything that is available in the shop. Because when I go on my PlayStation account and do these TV Metal Shop videos, you cannot see the things that I have already bought. And I have bought a fairly good amount of stuff, especially things that I do like. For example, this Vegeta artwork right here, I have bought on PlayStation. So you would not see it in the TV Metal Shop if I was on my PlayStation account. But with that being said, that is pretty much everything. Everything that you do need to know. I mean, you can take a look at the gifts really quick for anybody who would be interested in the gifts. There is a gift for Whis and a gift for Majub. For anybody that would be interested in those by any means, because I know still people do talk about them every now and then, but I personally do not need them at all. So again, that is everything that you need to know about this week's TP Metal Shop update. Let me know your thoughts down below in the comments. And again, let me know if this is something you would like me to continue more on the regular or just do more around DLC times, free update times things along those lines so let me know your thoughts down below in the comments but till next time boys thank you for watching hope you enjoyed and as always hope you guys have a good one hey shall